Hey, what's up everybody? It's Matt from Rocky's War Room. And tonight I have another Let's Build video for you from for the game Beyond the Gates of Antares, the 28mm sci-fi game by Warlord Games. And this one here is the Bormite Specialist Support Team with Plasma Light Support. Uh, I believe this is their smallest uh, uh, specialist support team that they have is the Plasma Light Support, but don't quote me on that. Um, it's a pretty awesome kit. Um, and uh, we're going to... Open it up and see what's inside. It comes in a blister pack. <clears throat> and I'm going to have... Thank you, Ronnie S. Yes, appreciate that. For packing this. So we got one big base. And three small bases for the, the guys. And here are the pieces. Alright. Just going to dump that out. Okay. So we got one metal piece. It looks like it goes inside this little ball area there. We got the gun itself. It's pretty. That's pretty much a plasma light support. Um, ah, there we go. Uh, plasma gun, typical plasma. We got three heads, obviously. And uh, go ahead and look at the uh, the Warlord's website. It'll show you which heads belong with which guy. Uh, obviously, you can do whatever you want, but I usually typically will uh, go on the Warlord's website and uh, look at the pic look up the picture to make sure I have the right thing. Um, all right. So we got this guy here. It's pretty awesome. One piece. <laughs> I love models. You don't have to sit there and put together. You got this fella here, and you got this fella here. So he's obviously probably going to have our visor, um, visor head. Uh, it looks like a pretty easy kit. Um, it's going to be a pretty quick video. Um, so I'm going to get right to it. Uh, I'm going to show you the tools. And then uh, after I show you the tools, you'll see uh, me put this together in its entirety. And after uh, I'm finished with it, uh, I'll tell you how I did it. Uh, some of the things to remember, some of my, the pitfalls of it. And then uh, we'll wrap it up with some uh, still photos. And uh, let's get to it. Back in a sec. There you have it. There is the <laughs> Bormite Specialist Support Team with Plasma Light Support. Um, real easy kit to put together. Uh, there's really not a lot to say. Um, honestly, if I could give you any tips on how I went together, 
Um, I glued this on first. There was not a lot of flash. I mean, I looked over them really good and I got a couple pieces, but that, that was it. Um, I would say line it up. If you're, if you're a stickler like me and you like things lined up in a certain way, I'd kind of hang this back on the base so it fits the base entirely and it's not hanging over. Um, put your base on the ball and then the gun on the top itself. And then the heads are pretty self-explanatory. Uh, what I do is I put a little glue on the head the part that's curved and then I uh, put a little dab the uh, head in a little bit of water and put it together because the CA glue that I use is activated with water uh, it activates and bonds quicker with if you get it wet so but uh, other than that it's a super simple kit uh, it's pretty awesome um, I have a, pla a light support now uh, to go along with my <laughs> my heavy guns so uh, for the bore mites itself so they'll look great next to my uh, my brood mother <laughs> and my boar cannon, my frag boars and stuff like that. So plenty of fire support, plenty of artillery, if you will, for beyond the gates of Antares. So uh, I hope you enjoyed this. Uh, I'll have some still shots before, before the end credits uh, after this. If you haven't subscribed, please do. Please tell a friend. Please spread the word. I'd really appreciate that. Hit that bell. Give me, give, leave me a comment. And last but not least, from me to you, ta-ta! And we'll catch you in the next video.